The scene of swaying of hanging lights has become a common sight, occurring almost daily since the strong tremors on April 3rd. In the early hours of Thursday morning, a series of four earthquakes struck Taiwan, ranging between magnitudes 3.9 and 5.6 on the Richter scale. Two earthquakes of magnitudes 5.6 and 5.5 occurred one minute apart, both fell throughout Taiwan, with the highest intensity recorded at level 3. However, the Central Weather Administration clarified that these four earthquakes were independent ones originating from the Nanao Basin, unrelated to the April 3rd earthquake. Professor Wu Yimin of the Department of Geosciences at the National Taiwan University explained that when their epicenter is further away, the time between the P wave and S wave increases. P waves can travel through liquid, solid and gases, while S waves only travel through solids. This phenomenon extends the time of tremor people could feel. However, the Taipei Basin experiences amplification due to its basin effect, making the shaking feel more pronounced. Conversely, the distance of the Nanao Basin results in larger discrepancies, prompting Yilan to receive a national level warning. However, examining geological cross-sections, it's evident that the epicenters of the four earthquakes and the April 3rd earthquake were different. Professor Li Shidi of the Institute of Applied Geology at National Central University noted that after the April 3rd quake, aftershocks were concentrated near the same fault zone, resulting in fewer earthquakes elsewhere. With the occurrence of the Nanao Basin earthquakes, aftershocks from the April 3rd earthquake are expected to decrease significantly, offering hope for reduction in aftershock frequency. With over 1,200 earthquakes accumulated by Thursday morning since the main earthquake, there is still a possibility of aftershocks within the next six months to a year. The Central Weather Administration urges the public to remain prepared and vigilant. Filoskowski, RTI News.